Hi, my friends. So today we're going to be able to read a book all about growing vegetables in the garden. Our title of our book is Up, Down, and Around. Our author is Katherine Ayers. Her job is to write the words. And our illustrator is Nadine Bernard Westcott. Her job is to make the pictures in our book. So today we're going to be able to read about the vegetables and how they grow. And this is our word card for grow. Can you say that word with your family members? Say grow. Now let's get ready to clap the syllables in our word for grow. Grow. There's only one syllable in our word for grow. And in Spanish we say crecer. Can you say that word with your family members? Again, say crecer. And now let's look at the picture on our word card. We can see that the plant is very tiny, that it's growing and growing. It is getting larger. So when we grow, that means we are getting larger. You're also growing too, friends. You're getting taller and larger. When you were a baby, you were very tiny, but now you are growing and you are getting bigger. Another thing that can grow is a cat. A cat, when they are a baby, is called a kitten. And when they grow up, they get bigger and larger, and then they are a full-grown cat. Can you turn and tell your family members, what are some other things that can grow? Hmm, I think trees can grow. Can flowers grow? What about this book? Can this book grow and get larger? No, that would be silly. We wouldn't be able to read it if it was too big. So when we, so we are going to get ready to read and we can read for different reasons. Sometimes we can read for fun and sometimes we can read to learn. Today we're going to read to learn how vegetables can grow. Up, Down, and Around by Katherine Ayers and illustrated by Nadine Bernard Westcott. Up, Down, and Around by Katherine Ayers. Before we start reading, sometimes there are confusing parts that we don't understand what's happening in the story, so we can look at the pictures to help us understand the words. That way we can clarify what is happening in the book. Today, we're going to be able to look at the pictures to see how the vegetables grow. Let's start reading. In the dirt, we'll dig a row, drop some seeds, and watch them grow. Dirt piles up, seeds go down. Water splashes around and around. Corn grows up. Can you use your pointer finger and point up? Carrots go down. Now use your pointer finger and point down. Hmm, I need some help clarifying what is happening in our book so far. Can you take out your magnifying glasses to look at the different pictures? Carrots and corn are both vegetables. How do they grow? They grow in different ways. The corn grows up out of the ground and carrots grow down below the ground. So we can see that vegetables grow in lots of different ways. Cucumbers climb around and around. Peppers grow up like the corn. Potatoes grow down like the carrots grow down too. Can you point up like the peppers and the corn are growing up? And now can you use your pointer finger to point down like the potatoes and the carrots? Pumpkins vine around and around. Hmm, let's look at the picture again. I need help clarifying what is happening. Use your magnifying glasses to look at the picture. How do pumpkins grow differently than other vegetables? Do they grow underground? Do they grow up above the ground, up high? Can you turn and tell your family members how you think the pumpkins grow? The pumpkins grow along the ground, around and around on vines. Vegetables grow in lots of different ways. Broccoli grows up, beets grow down. 
Green beans wind around and around. Okra grows up, onions grow down. Tomatoes twine around and around. Fresh and tasty. Get a bunch, pick some, pull some. Hmm, look at the illustrations on the different pages. I need help clarifying what is happening in the story. Use your magnifying glasses and look. What are the characters in our story doing with the vegetables? They are harvesting the vegetables. Let's help them. Can you pretend with your family members to reach up, up, up high to pick the corn? And then can you pick some tomatoes that are growing around and around? Now let's pretend to pull some carrots up from under the ground. Let's have lunch. Yummy. Look at all those different vegetables the family and friends are eating. The end. So today we were able to read and learn how vegetables grow. Remember, when something grows, that means it is getting larger. Grass can grow very quickly, so it needs to be cut by people with lawnmowers. Vegetables can grow in people's gardens. Turn and talk to your family members. Have you ever seen a plant grow before? Maybe it was a flower or a vegetable. How did it look? when it was first planted? And then how did it look after it grew a little bit more from a tiny seed or a sprout? Now that we have read about how vegetables grow, we can talk more about how they grow too. Thank you for reading today with me, my friends. Bye.